Hello. What does it mean? Let me come in. We got a Wednesday stream. What is this? Anyway. We drink our two today. Yes, we're back at our two finally. I've been waiting so long for this hype. Let me join Discord easy. If anyone wants to call or talk or whatever, then sure, I guess. Okay. This. So let me do this. Okay. So let me put some front and I think we're fine. Um, let me put this. Okay. So let's start off with some practice. That's basically the thing we have to do every time. No exceptions. Let me, let me put my mic closer. Didn't really think about that. My god, these are so stupid. Okay, there we go. That's a bit better. Today's goal is nothing major. I highly doubt I'm gonna be. We'll see. So it's the fixed play, you just have to do one thing. Which I learned that I'm not on time to the system with, but could play the run. I believe in it. Okay, so let's die. Let me party a bit, because that's not nice. The game being too loud. In case it's too quiet, let me know, honestly. Okay, now I just took the wrong angle, that's awesome. Nah. Yeah, I'm not too consistent with it, but can still do it from time to time. That was barely, I would say. Let me do tomb real quick. So we got the one thing here. Then after some more practice we can begin running the video game. Yes. On this underscore on the one that on keg practice. Yes, real turn. Well, that was easy. All right, let's switch levels. Hi. Hi, Peyton. Uh, how's you? Fine. How about you? I'm good. I took my walk earlier. My walk of life. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Oh, let me say I'm happy I finished the ILs before the year was over. Yeah, that was cool. Good job on that. Yeah. I'm surprised how fast the Crow's Nest IL took me. Because of fast coves? Uh, just the fact that I was uh, getting the cutscene skip without pause buffering somewhat quickly and the RNG I was getting. Oh yeah, 
That's for sure. Does this mean I feel comfortable doing it without pause buffering, though? Mm, definitely not. Especially that long into the run. Mm-hmm. And I'm still trying to adapt to it. So the other thing we're gonna do today, as well in the run, is the Bayou GLM thingy, which is cool. I still need to figure out what I'm doing wrong with it. Because hmm. every time I get random teleports and it just throws off the GLM. That's sad. That's not mm -hmm. cool. Because uh, uh, 30 FPS is changing my jumping heights. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, I thought so. <sighs> oh, by the way, last night I played Croc. <laughs> oh, nice. I mean... What can you say? He's a cute baby crocodile. Yeah, he's cute. <laughs> so every time I watch Cat Icarus with the Croc 2 video, I like how he's like, Yeah, that's cheating, but at least I'm not an abandoned Yoshi game. <laughs> Which that is sad to know that Croc is actually banned in Yoshi game. Yeah. It was supposed to be a Yoshi game. Mm-hmm. I mean, I like how the final project looks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and do you know what the gobbles were... What color they were originally supposed to be? What were they supposed to be? Pink. Why? I don't know. But then they thought brown because it would look better in the scenery. I guess. Amanda's cat acres hates Croc too. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when Darnock was in my stream when I played through Croc 1, he said he's not the biggest fan of it. Oh, really? Yeah. Funny, because I think he speedrun that game. Uh, it was Croc 1 that I saw him speedrun. Hmm. He did hoverless on MU. Oh. I still can't believe hovering exists, though. <laughs> yeah, crazy. I think one. I think one reason I'm not the biggest fan of it is because of the different types of hovers you can get. I guess. All right. So I mean that's. Practice. I mean, that's one reason. <laughs> yes. No movies. Okay. Are you ready? Red eye. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Actually, what I tried to do last night was see if I could play Jack 2, but uh, my game wasn't working. Oh no, Sanj. Yeah, so the best thing I thought of after that was playing Croc. Hmm. 
I mean, if I'm gonna eventually speedrun it, I need to get a feel with the game. Yeah. Well, that's a bad lose of light. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, it's hard to get a good woods of light sometimes. Yeah. I mean, even when I go for that jump ledge grab, it sometimes doesn't work for some reason. Hmm. My theory is maybe because I'm not jumping at the wall at the correct angle. Maybe. Because I know when you jump against certain walls, you get extra height. Four seconds. Yikes. At least I can guarantee a glod on Fairy Glade today. Chant. Glod. <laughs> that's a funny way of saying gold. Yeah, that's what people say. Also, that was a really good Emerson. Wow. Happy you guys have a good, consistent air swim now. Yeah. Not that jittery collision. Seizure inducing glitch. Yeah, that one sucks. <laughs> From what I've seen, every PC run, it looked very annoying. It does look annoying. Especially the fact originally you had to do it twice. I mean, you do it once actually, but er earlier you had to do it twice, yeah. Exactly. I need to learn how to do the roll boost constantly, even though I know now. I just don't really I mean, have the inputs. Yeah, I mean, even though I knew, it took me a while to get the muscle memory in. Hmm. And hey, sometimes I still mess it up because I try to go too fast. Oh wow, I shot in the cutscene. Cool. Hmm. Um the Fairy Glade 3 cutscene. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can shoot into certain cutscenes like sometimes I've done it in the Clark cutscene in Min in Minaire Hills. Huh. Kind of funny. <laughs> yeah. Also, it's one of those why not shots I like to do. <laughs> mm. Wow, didn't get hit, nice. By the way, you weren't upset when I said I was going to retire for the rest of the year, were you? Nah. Alright, good. Like I said, it's, it's been hard with Rayman 2 with me this year. <laughs> I guess. Also, this well, was the year of huge discoveries, kinda. True. And I guess also the fact that I had to grind sub one hour in Rayman 3 Game Boy. Oh yeah, that one was tough. Mm-hmm. And the fact I still want to push any percent further in the future. Oh wow. In other words, yes, I'm a glutton for punishment. <laughs> But then again, aren't we all? <laughs> yeah. I oh! Hit the switch.
Don't you wish the switch could work in Paraglide 3? Yeah, I wish it could work. Yeah, but unfortunately you have to be close to it. Yep. So sad. I mean, I wish I could figure out how to do the laser fence clip consistently. It would be cool, but I, you would be using a lot of lumps, though. Uh, I don't think so on all masks. Well, on all masks, it wouldn't really matter because you can get tons of lumps. Exactly. But, uh, but for any percent, that's a different story. Yeah. And also, it wouldn't matter in 100% because you gotta get all the lums. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Unless you want to, um, go for the cage in the FG1, I guess. That one cage, um, in that, that is hanging on the wood thingy. Oh, the, the one lum cage. Yeah. I see, yeah. I think that was I, I still think it sounds weird hearing rollout sounds on this version. Hmm. Interesting. Are they different? Well, it's just on N64, Rayman doesn't make any rollout sounds. Oh. So when I first heard it on PC, it just felt very weird hearing Rayman go, oof, when he rollouts. I guess. That does sound a bit weird. Yeah, especially if I grew up with a console that he doesn't make any of those rollout sounds. Yep. I guess also the different carrying sounds. Yes, those are different. Oh, that lum you grab when you get the tornado skip, it's kind of tricky to get on N64. Oh, really? Yeah. Hmm. I think it's on N64, I get teleported to a slightly different position. Did I get every? Uh, yeah, you did. Okay, so I gotta change my um, lamb count in the splits then. Oops. <laughs> but we're glutting. Sad Rayman. <laughs> yeah. This portal boost thing, I'm still wondering what's the best strategy for me when exiting the portal in marshes. Some people walk, some people strafe. No, I don't mean that. Oh. Yo! I mean, like, on the first visit, I don't do a portal boost because it gives me... I think it gives me a better line for the cutscene skip. Oh. <gasps> Wait, how did you miss that switch? I don't know. But I'm not gonna reset. I'm gonna lose time, but I'm not gonna reset. Alright. Because on the second visit here, I do a portal boost, because I think it helps with the roll boost lineup to Cave of Bad Dreams. Actually, there's one thing I've been studying, and I still don't understand to this very day how this rope works. I don't know. Because, like, sometimes it has extra slack, and other times it doesn't. Hmm. Which makes Rockless kind of iffy. I guess.
But I had backups though, why did I die? Hmm. Oh well. If I die now from these bombs... Okay, I didn't. If only I could Z through those bombs. Yeah. I mean, at least I can do it with the zombie chickens. That final five limb, I used to jump for it, but now I just steer into it. Interesting. Okay, we own. Wow, we actually. Actually, this marsh has sucked, never mind. I think dying mar in marshes in general just sucks. Yeah, let's see how much I'm behind. I am eight seconds almost. Not bad. Huh. Could have been worse. Yeah, true. Like, you could have missed a lump in the rock jump. Which, that by default loses so much time. Yep. I decided I'm gonna shoot in the cutscene thing, so that I know if I'm going. That's a good idea, so you don't, like, stupidly fall in the water or something. Yeah, or get stuck in collision, I guess. Mm-hmm. Missing one of those three lums, that's easily the most annoying mistake to make. Yeah, it's annoying. I know, uh, before I had to switch controllers, uh, I've been getting, like, low 135s, maybe high 134s. Nice. Yeah, but the problem is that since I have to adjust to different angles, I'm getting slightly slower times. Oh. Well, that's the thing. I just need to adjust to this controller, and then maybe I can get low 135s again. Hmm. I'm gonna skip this one, because I don't know what time I should be to skip that one. I think this time is fine. Alright. Because usually I get to that mushroom at like 24 on the timer. It's fine. Also, where you skip that checkpoint, I figured out how to get those three lums with using one helicopter. Nice. No! Ugh. Oh, what it? What? I know the wrong file! Ah. Uh, I guess this means the run's me dead. Up. I guess this means the run's dead. Yeah, it's dead. Sag. Yeah, but. Uh, wow! Let me restart the game. Maybe then the order will change. Because that was weird. Oh, uh. There's something I wonder. Uh, have you noticed when I have you noticed when I start runs, I kind of mash the camera towards the towards the slide. Mm, no. Like basically, I tap C left so, to get the camera to where the slide is, so I could just run straight. Mm. But here's what I've wondered: is that if I turn Rayman's angle without moving him, does that count as moving? I don't know. I'd have to ask Darnok. Yeah, I guess. Because I know there's the... The Z target with uh, changing his angle and also going into first person. Hmm. Oh, camera. Wow. The camera can do that sometimes, which is why I mash C, mash C down. <laughs> oh. I 
I remember that jump for PC runners used to be very hard. Yeah, and now people use it all the time. Yeah, it's thanks to roll boosting. Yeah. I've even noticed that some short jumps I used to do were very tricky to do. And wow. now with roll boost now with roll boosting they're almost free. <laughs> wow, I lost time to this one? Interesting. Like a millisecond or something. Oh my hundred percent record, I'm happy I finally got an eleven slide. Hmm. Uh, the jail slide, I finally got an 11. Nice. I guess you could say it was my dream. <laughs> I guess. Because most PC runners, I see them get 11s when they hit the cutscene, and come on, grab the lum, Rayman. <laughs> yeah, didn't want to be magnetic today. Yeah, as soon as they hit the cutscene, I see them get 11s, and what I kept usually get was 12s. Hmm. Because I think I did slightly safer stuff. That's a roll boost. Optimally climbing up that tree is really fun. Really? Yes. Hmm. I don't know about that. I mean, how we're utilizing roll boosts on the branches and trying to reduce climbing. I guess. I mean, how's it boring for you? I don't know, actually. <laughs> well, then again... People have their own tastes. Yeah. Pretty much. I sometimes wonder why Torg9 and Torsten don't do that when falling into this area. I don't know, you get like, I think you get a higher velocity of falling down? That. Yeah, that's that's what you do when you jump off certain ledges. <laughs> I mean, if you see my runs, I usually do that. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah, that's why I do the I do the left side so I get one instead of two. Mm -hmm. You. Oh no, I have to come back to it. I was about to say don't clip so he would. <laughs> <laughs> also, without helicoptering here, this jump looks scary. Uh, it is scary, but when you when you get a feel for it, it's not that bad. <laughs> Compared to other jumps in the game. I guess. Like, optimally, uh, those, uh, tumbling platforms at the end of Rock and Lava, too. It's so difficult to do short jumps there. Yeah. Especially the first one, because... Okay, that happened. <laughs> That's okay, that what happened. You said. I don't care. Wait, let's see. Okay, the low is on the top here. Yeah, the first platform, the short jump is possible, but it's very tight. 
And if you fail, you fall in the lava and die. Which, time-wise, that's not a big deal, but the problem is you lose a gold glove. Yikes. Mm-hmm. Oh, by the way, imagine in the Beneath uh, Rock and Lava Isle one day I get Fouch Skip. Imagine. Right now, I consider that a 2023 thing. I guess. If my sanity will let me. <laughs> Which will probably not, because that trick is hard. Yeah, and inconsistent. That too. Remember when you guys didn't know if it was faster to get that cutscene or to skip it? Yeah, I remember. And that, hmm. I guess? I don't know. Blood? We got a blood. Nice. Oh, wow, and you missed the first lum. Yeah, 118. This is still not good. <laughs> no offense, but I have seen better. Yeah. Especially how Tart9 accidentally got a gold. Yeah, this was yesterday, right? From what I remember, yes. That was interesting. Mm-hmm. <gasps> that, that, that's so close. One or two more frames and you would have gone back in bounds. Yeah, definitely. Oh, have you noticed if you hold two of the buttons, Rayman could just go slightly up or down while going horizontal? No. I found that out just by testing the swimming controls, and I thought maybe it could be useful with swimming down and straight to the loading zone in Whale Bay, too. Maybe. I thought that, but the thing is, is that I think it's more about going in a straight line than it is swimming down. Oh. Because Rayman swims faster than just running. If he's swimming in a straight line. I guess so. He, he is kind of fast. In, well, swimming can go on. I was surprised to find that out because usually swimming in games is slower. True, isn't that right, Crash? Hmm. To be fair, he no. more like w walks in water than in Crash, please. Hmm. In those ancient Egypt levels. Yeah, Tomb Waiter. Yep. Tomb Prater. Hmm. Let me just say the time trial on Tomb Waiter, it's probably one of my least favorites. Really? Yeah, mostly because I have to wait every time I fail because of the water cycle. Oh. And one visual cue I figured out for the timing was uh, this lineup on the bug at the very start of the level. <laughs> wow. Nice jump, I guess. It's that like you so and the pirate. Risky. It's like you and the pirate were synchronized with that jump. Yeah. If only there was some RNG manipulation. I mean, manipulation overall. True. Speaking of RNG manipulation, that reminds me of how they found that for Kirby 64. Really? Yeah, I don't understand. I don't know how it works, so please don't ask me. Well, that's an auto reset. That's a sad. Loss. Hey! Five milliseconds away from like a sub 13. 
Hmm. Oh, by the way, you know those Murphy uh, vocal effects aren't original? What? No way. Yeah, they're actually from a Goofy cartoon. Wow. And what's funny is that they took a lot of sound effects from this game and uh, Donald Duck going quackers for PS1. Hmm. I think even N64 as well. Interesting. Like, there are these enemies, the invisible uh, enemies, and they make the same Murphy voice sa samples. Huh. To be fair, samples could be commonly used. I mean, or even to use some samples in its OST. True. And that's old games for ya. Yep. Glon? There was a 117. Wow. Ah, you're getting better, Fox. Heh, <laughs> Star Fox 64 reference. I mean, somebody had to reference it. I guess. That was fast. Which I can't wait till I stream Star Fox. <laughs> <laughs> it may not be your thing, but it's definitely my thing. Yeah, it's not my thing. Is it because you're not into space shooters? Not that, I just never really cared about Star Fox. To be fair, I I only own one Nintendo console that could play a Star Fox game. Wow, what's that? Um, new to DS. Oh, no Rollbooks, I guess. Oh, the DS one. Yeah, 3DS. That's uh, Star, Star Fox. Fox 3D. Star Fox 64 3D. Yeah. I'm sorry, but that game is trash. In other words, just play Star Fox 64. It's a million times better. I guess. That, and let that's... me just say, the, ex the explosions when you kill the bosses in the 3DS, it's so underwhelming. I wonder what is it. Does we have any Star Fox games? No. Okay. Star Fox only exists on uh, Super Nintendo, N64, GameCube, and uh, DS, Star Fox Command, huh. and Star Fox Zero on Wii U. Hmm. Well, to be fair, Oli has a GameCube compatibility, so I guess I could play Star Fox Adventures. A lot of people don't like that game, which is dumb. Well, from what I've seen, it's not really like... A Star Fox game? Okay, can you? I hate that layer so much. Yeah, and that could have been a re really good entry to the stronghold. And it's not only the layer, but also that ledge on the corner, how Rayman just decides not to grab it. Yeah. Uh, back to what you were saying about adventures. Uh, it's understandable because it does look more like a Zelda game. Oh, really? Yeah. That's funny. Well, here's the thing is that they got to remember that it originally wasn't going to be a Star Fox game. It was supposed to be a different game. Yeah, Dinosaur Planet on N64. Oh, yeah. N64. Wow. Yep. But because of the characters resembling more like Fox characters, Miyamoto decided to turn it into a Star Fox game. He really couldn't think of any ideas. So he was like, let's put Star Fox. Mm-hmm. And Steve Malpass, a guy who worked in at Rare. Mm -hmm. That was close. Uh, he's the guy who voiced uh, Fox McCloud in the game. Oh. Nice, I got some roll boosting. Actually, before coming to your stream, I watched a Star Fox Adventure speedrun. Oh, is it? Does it look complicated? Uh, let's just say, if you 
if you think Zelda Ocarina Time speedruns are complicated, then look at Star Fox Adventures. It's just as complicated. Huh. Also, I really suck today, don't I? <laughs> I mean, there are days I suck at this game. Hmm. Or I end up resetting on this level so much, or Woods of Light, or even Marshes. I guess. That's why you gotta master them. But here's the thing, I can practice them a million times, but that's not going to change anything. Hmm. Because they're still going to be the same levels that we sometimes love to hate. <laughs> yeah. And you're always you're always going to mess up on one tiny little thing, unless you're Tass. To be fair, when is Tass not good? Exactly. Oh, you go to that patch first? Yeah, I don't know, I haven't played in a while, so I forgot how to do it. Um, I mean, the optimal order I do is center, right, then left. Oh. Also, right there, you don't have to walk that far. You could walk just a little bit before the bridge, and then you can throw it. Yeah, I never really learned that, honestly. For the patch on the left, you can be, like, to the left and halfway across the bridge and you'll target it. Oh, wow. Well, that's good to know. Yeah, as for the one on the right, I try to get on the right side and just walk a little bit past the bridge. Hmm. I try roll boosting in this corridor and it's very inconsistent with the camera. Oh. Because sometimes the camera gets stuck on a wall and has to recenter, which messes up my my movement. No roll boost. I can't get over how this area's music is so different between this and N64. Yeah, here is like more uncomfortable, I would say. Mm hmm I guess they have more for action adventure feel on N sixty four with Yep. With trying to get out of Fairy Glade. I mean the the soundtrack is called Escaping the Fairy Glade. Oh. Hmm. Is that's like I didn't know. I mean it does feel like that's what we're doing. Yeah. Ah, uh, oh well. Wait, I could have gotten 39 lumps in this level. Wow. So I guess I was correct on the splits. No blood, but still decent. Sub 9. Also, I noticed, I noticed that portal entry was not good. Yeah, it was not good. Because I usually. I could usually go all the way to the wall and then you'll insta portal. Hmm. Can the marshes please be nice? Please don't be nice. Give me the little. Okay. Go! Is Rayman saying go there? No. Uh, who is no. it? No. Turn. I always thought it was a narrator saying that. Huh. If only there was a narrator. I mean, there is, if you listen to the PS2 version on the prison ship cutscenes. And PS1. Uh, yeah, PS1. But we don't talk about that. I'm just kidding. Yeah. Who talks about R2 PS1? Cringe. I mean, maybe one day if I find it, maybe I could learn to speedrun it. I want to speed on R2 PS1 as well. 
I mean, one benefit with that one is that we could skip cutscenes on it. Yeah. Which means Yo! the second best version to speedrun. Also, I died. Thanks, game. Yeah, it's just one problem is that um, how it works, it feels like a completely different game. It does, and it doesn't feel the best to move, honestly, in 30 FPS. Trust oh, me. Oh, the game goes... Wait, the game goes 30? Maybe even less, I don't know. Oh, gosh. I thought it goes at least 60 or something. Nah. I mean, at least N64, 30 frames plays good. I guess. But why does it look like on PC Rayman runs slower? I don't know. Actually, it kind of does. We only lost, also... like, around a second. Also, it looks like he's a little heavier with his jumps. That too. I don't know, maybe it's just frame rate differences. Maybe. I have noticed something weird with my down right and down left angles on my new controller. They feel slightly different. Oof. Which, that's kind of problematic, especially on the slides. That's not good. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Which is why my uh, prison ships have been a little... iffy, I guess. I guess so. No, I still think it's crazy how many backups I've thought of on Prison Ship Slide. Insane. Mm-hmm. Even at the start of the second section, I figured out some backups. I hope that's enough time. Uh, it should be. I think unless you take close. bad... I think unless you take bad lines, I think you got it. Alright, I think I got it. Yeah. Close. Also, when the counter reaches zero, you, you still have milliseconds. Huh. Like, it's not like as soon as it hits zero, you die. Hmm. I right, don't mess up the load warp. Okay, now it was fine. And we even saved time. Three seconds. Wow. Nice. Also, this barrel, it actually spawns immediately as soon as the level loads on N64. Oh, wow. The only downside is I can't move during the cutscene. Oh. Do you think moving during the cutscenes here were, was an oversight? I guess. Because... I think the PC version was made before N64. I don't think so, because I think RT was made with N64 in mind. Well, to mm. be fair, on PC version you have A and B textures in the Nemesis, so I guess. Uh. Purple arm skip when? 2023. Sounds right. That is if PC players will be able to get it. I think it's crazy how some of these crazy tricks I do, I make it look very easy. Yeah, for sure. Sometimes when I mess up and then get it, I'm like, was that so hard? Sometimes I feel like I'm kind of tricking my mindset. I guess that's a good thing. Yeah, because I don't want to overthink some of these tricks and then just mess up just to overthinking. Yeah. 
All right, five GLM time. Time to lose the run. Nice. I was gonna say that should work. It was alright, I guess, but there were some stuff that I didn't like. There is something that does feel uncomfortable with me doing that is that the barrels are on a different cycle than I'm used to. Oh. Should glad. It's nice. <laughs> My SOB is gonna get better. In fact, I failed damage by you and still continued the run on 100%. Yeah, and you still world record. Yeah. It just I did not want to go in that loop of resetting an early game for the for an hour or two. Yep. That's really close to Glot, oh wow. Like three seconds or something. Wow. Alright, water and ice. Let's go. And I'm not doing the strats others do. Are you talking about the Torg 9 strat? Um, the, uh, the boost thingy. Um, Oof. instead of going to the fight from by feet. That's the target 9 strat I was talking about. Alright. I didn't know what else to call it. Same. Here's the uh, cage. Sometimes jumping out to that platform is awkward with how the camera is. Yeah. I guess. All I know is PC runners, they need to take note of my movement getting out of, of that cave. I guess so. Even, even Torque 9 doesn't know how to do it properly. Huh. Alright, air swim time. Time to be stupid. I still have bad memories. I still have bad memories of that 5 lum going right through me and didn't collect it. Oh no. Really? Yes, it was terrible and I hate it so much, which is why I don't just I don't jump for it anymore. I can imagine and... it being horrible. Mm-hmm. Nice. Oh, you did the yellow setup? No, I didn't. It was kind of no, that is setup. I mean, you didn't swim into the wall, then swim down and shoot. Oh well, that I didn't do. But like, I set up myself with a uh, visual cue with the line. Oh, I wasn't talking about the visual cue. I was talking about the execution for the clip. Oh, then yeah. That's the yellow setup that Alos hates. <laughs> what? Oh. I think okay. he grab there. That's what it looked like. I do know you can ledge grab there, but I didn't know you could do it at that angle. Mm -hmm. Or at least attempt it at that angle. I'm gonna be a bit safe here. Ew, who plays safe in a speed run? For real. Oh yeah, you told me you hate the backwards lum that I do in prison ship. Yeah. It's a beep. Hmm. But I figured out ways to make it work. Nice. Alright, BLJ time. 
You got Made it. it. I was gonna say, if that's not it, I'm calling shenanigans. Heh. <laughs> also, this made Glod. Which is nice. That was pretty smooth, honestly. Yeah. Even though this air swim setup took a bit. Yeah. Um, I saved 40 seconds, wow. Wow, this means you're really getting better, Fox. Yeah. Oh. Oh, you messed it up. Yeah. Sometimes I swear the shot hits the switch and it doesn't hmm. for me. Hi, Cobble. It's going alright so far. This is our best run yet. Oh no, I wasted time. How does this shell work when you go into that a hole? I don't know. I guess it stops or something. I don't know. Shell. Well, it's still Please. acting like it's still acting like it's running because when you get out of it, it stops. Yeah. Maybe his running timer is going while the area is unloaded. Maybe. Donut Bob today? No. Not happening, I figure. Oh, by the way, Vitamin, what do you think of the hitbox of shooting the pirates? Mm, interesting. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, it's not the best hitbox, but it is interesting. It's ma it crashed. No. It oh. crashed Bandicoot. Yep. You guys, you guys do that cage strat, and what's that is that I'm still not doing it to this day. Why? Probably because I have to worry about my angle and also the fact I have trust issues with lums. It's not that bad. On PC, maybe, but what about N64? Well, I don't know. Maybe the collision is different there. No, the collision is the same. It's just... The problem is I... Oh, you missed a lump. Oh, well... It, the problem is how I set up my camera and how I set up my angle. Hmm. Woo! Alright. By the way, who still hates that jump? Me. I'm raising my hand. Alright, time to do this one. Alright, come on, EEC. Please be nice. Please don't be nice. Nice. At least the air swim was nice. Yeah, I'm still half consistent with it. I mean, it does look cool how you're using GLM to make it work. Yeah, that's cool. And it's definitely way better than the other thing, trust me. Oh, I definitely I can tell. I'm sad N64 doesn't have a lot of GLMs. Saj. Like, the only GLMs that are useful are the Tornado Skip and the Bayou, if I could figure out how to do it consistently. Hmm. Alright, EEC, please be nice. Alright. Will the, will the run continue? Will or the run will die? Fail. We'll find out after these messages. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> That's right, not good. Ah! Oh. Yeah, I called it. Honestly. Because I sucked at this today. I think what happened was when you went through the second wall, I think you were too far right. Yeah, that's my problem, literally, right now. It looked like it was barely gonna work, but the floor's collision pushed you. Yeah. It said, nah. It said, nah. But don't worry, guys, we can save tons of time. I, I remember one time... I remember one time learning this glitch, I accidentally jumped into the cutscene and I was really, really mad. Oh no. 
Because it was like the game didn't even give me a chance. Come on, game. Please. Uh. Phew! Wow, worked. Made it. Now get the checkpoint and we're in the clear. We can save those of time in top of the world for sure because I didn't get this fast cycle. So hey, every time I see every time I see the PC runner shoot this plum, do they go to the center or the left of the bridge? I don't know, I go to the left because of free camera. Uh, I do left because it, it makes it one hundred percent accurate with Rayman shooting the plum. Hmm. We gotta run officially, I guess. Before we need to get to the precipice. That could be problematic. Those spires, it's awkward to jump on those on N64 because of how notoriously laggy it is. Oh no. You know what I even have to do? What do I have to do? I have to zigzag to lose speed. Yikes. Because I know some people could just stop, but the thing is, is that if I stop, I'm just going to waste time. Hmm. So I thought the best thing to do to slow down was to zigzag. We have two minutes. Can we do it? Go! Cage, thank you. I remember EEC used to be... Uh... I guess, uh... Really hard? Retry heavy. Not hard, but I guess retry heavy because you could try again, but now you don't get to try again. Understandable, honestly. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, it's like, if you fail it, then you reset. You can't try again because of how optimized the game is now. Yeah. Go! Go! Especially Maybe. since Glackham... Especially since Glackham was the only one who did it at the time. Oh, wow, really? Even Dark yeah. didn't do it? No, he had to learn it. And also, he was a little busy still taking a break from Rayman. Oh, understandable, I guess. So that was slow. Go! But we all save time, luckily, still. Somehow. Darnox 106 run... He got almost every hard trick except for the Armantis uh, branch. Armantis free, I mean. Hmm. Well, he got every hard trick except for branch skip because he had nerves. Yeah, understandable, especially when you're playing on the keyboard. Mhm. Mm I I was just joking around saying, "Wow, what a wuss." <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I to I totally understand. It's definitely nerve wracking at the very end of the game. Yeah. You know, it's funny. We're still saving time. <laughs> no offense, uh, Vitamin, but I wouldn't be surprised with how your gameplay is. Hmm. Again, I'm not saying that to be mean. I'm just saying you're still uh, in the process. Yeah. And we're still gonna have to get this lump boost. And not skip a single lump. All right, if you didn't miss that lum in Monair Hills, I guess you wouldn't get a backup. Yeah. What am I doing? Are you trying to back it up? No. I need to try again. What am I doing, man? Well, it runs dead. Yeah. I guess I gotta go with this now. Let's just finish the run. I need, I need to get in that process of just finishing runs, even if they are trash. Yeah. How much does this save, <laughs> anyway? Uh, the lump boost? Yeah. Well, that's checkpoint grab. Uh, 50 seconds. Oh, wow. Then, yeah, this is a huge time loss. Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. I was saying you missed lumps from the cage. Who cares, though? <laughs> Normally, we would skip those. 
You know, that's why I was like, no, wait, never mind. But yeah, I timed going through this section optimally while getting a, a really fast Crespus skip, and it was 50 seconds. Hmm. Which makes it worth it. Yeah, I guess. On the positive note, we can skip some lumps at least. Eh, yeah, true. But then we would get fake gloves, though. I was gonna ask, do you think with uh, doing this now, you could uh, do the void in Rock and Lava, but then I realized, no, no. that skips way too many. And I never even performed it, I think. Okay, we got five extra lumps from that. Hop! So, what we could- what could we skip? You could skip that annoying Cage 5 lum in Rock and Lava. Oh, yeah! And save Golden Fist or something. Well, not really, but... Hmm. All I know is that Cage is very annoying. It is. It's not a bad, but loses golden gloves, which is sad. I thought I could skip maybe um, the Tomb of the Ancients cage, but nah, it has too many lumps, like extra five lumps. Are you talking about at the beginning? Yeah. Ending? No, no, I'm talking about no. the ending. Oh, right, the ending. Actually, it has 10, right? Yeah. And we have 5... Actually, one what? Well, that's yeah, 4 the lump now. Can... No, you can grab it still. But I'm not gonna. Oh, I thought you did grab it still. I'm not gonna say you did, because I might... Mess you up with the lum route. To be fair, I don't. I, I don't have a lum route right now. That it's really safe or you know, whatever. True. I will say routing lums in this game is fun. I guess. Do you just prefer without collecting lums from Revolution? I prefer Revel lum collecting. Hmm. Because you can skip all of them. I know, that's what I was saying. The only ones you have to get are the first five in the game. Yeah. One of my IL attempts, I actually got the auto jump, but I helicoptered instantly back onto the bridge. Ouch. What do you mean, ouch? That helped, because I got Rayman out of the air. Oh. I'm just, I'm just not focusing, I guess. I don't know. I understand. But yeah, Kobaltski can't wait till we start running R2. I think that would be cool. I will say, you didn't have to go this much to the right. I don't know, man. I'm still learning. Still in your board. I'm still noting uh, what you could do. Hmm. Provide my knowledge of the game. Oh, this sucked, man. Oh, you got damage boosts forward instead of back. I, yeah. You start running oh. when you get sub one hour or free. Yeah, see you in like 10 years, man. Hmm. This troll bridge. How th how's killing those walking shells on PC? It's okay, I would say. It's terrible on N64. Oh, really? Yeah, because one time all those shots and none of them hit and hit the first red shell at the start of three. Hmm. It happened in my 100% world record and I got really mad. Um. And we're in the red. Oh, you still... Die, man. But well, here's the question: Was I more mad at unnecessary time loss, or just mad because I lost a gold glove? That I lost golden glove. Mhm. Mm Especially to something that was not my fault. 
Rip gold is for Clark. Nah, we get golden gloves in beneath. I mean, in Sanctuary of Rock and Lava. Uh, f we can collect 44 lumps here. Thanks for the good luck, Umzi. Hi, Umzi. <laughs> By the way, still one of my favorite auto scrollers. It's cool. Also, I think I know what lumps I'm gonna skip. That sounds like payment. It is payment. The one and only. <laughs> Unless somebody's impersonating me. <laughs> hmm. It's the payment, the professional R2 and 64 air swim. Uh, gather. Hmm. Well, except for Whale Bay 1, because that one's very inconsistent. Yep. It's basically like original Fairy Glade Air Swim PC. Mm -hmm. Um, quick question, by the way. Do you know how many lumps the first uh, cage gets you in, top, in top of the world? If I remember correctly, I think it's three. Alright. Go! Go! Why are you gonna skip it? How's everything going for everything? Everything is okay, except that I lost a really good run in Precipice. And yeah. That beginning music of Top of the World 2 sounds very weird. I like it. I mean, it's alright, but it just sounds off to me. I think it sounds something more in Spyro than it does Rayman. Maybe. Is this good? Is this is good, I think. Yes, it's good. Nice, we're saving time. Cause somehow I didn't get this originally. I was counting in my head, and my head's saying that it is three in the cage. Okay. Bye, Rayman. <laughs> you know what? I'm still gonna. Never mind. I'm gonna get this anyway. Yep, I was right. Um, I need four more lumps. I can skip those. Yeah, I guess how, how out of the way they are. I guess you could skip the one on the box up here. Yeah. Oh. I could. I'm just wasting time. And that's enough. Saving time. With a fake glod. Though I could definitely I do say better normally. I will say that lump on the box, on top of the box, it's kind of fun to get with the roll boosting, especially how you can bonk your head on the ceiling. Oh, really? Yeah, so you can land on the ground sooner. Hmm. Oh, last stream I tried that. And failed? I was getting the first one, but the second one, I just don't know what I'm doing wrong. Hmm. Probably because I can't guys. see. You can get the PvP. Probably because I... Well, like I was saying, it was probably because I can't see where Rayman is related to the bridge. Hmm. Especially since N64 has a lower res, since I have to use that. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I cycle. I wonder if Robo Sync is faster, probably not. Uh, it is on the first two, but for the rest, it's not. Alright. That's good to know. Because I usually keep a roll boost from bouncing off the barrel. Mm -hmm. Woo! 
thought I was gonna bong the bridge. Nice hitbox. That was a nice hitbox on the purple lum. <laughs> Now, if I do remember, this is the most optimal way. Uh, it was it was bottom right, bottom left, middle, top right, top left. Hmm, okay. So you were right at first, but the last two, uh, it's understandable. Because hmm. that, that's you. That's what I used to do, but until someone showed a, I guess like a line chart. Oh. Because you have to walk to the left when you go through that alcove. Hmm. So, so it makes sense. When I can like drop here. That's not well boost. What am I doing? Okay. Wasting time like I do if I miss a roll boost. <laughs> yep. Pretty much. Oh, that flower. Have you noticed I'm risky with jumping onto it? Why? I do a low jump. Why? Uh, it's optimal. It's faster. Oh. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, except for the ones on the neck coming up. Yeah. By the way, the plant music trigger, isn't it weird with how it starts between this and N64? Hmm. Especially the fact it starts as soon as I go down the hole. I thank for the worst flower jump in the game. One day I should see how bad it is on PC. I just don't like it. Maybe that's a me thing. I mean, by default, I heard Glackham and some other people don't like it. Huh. Probably because one thing, you get a small frame window to jump off of it at 60 FPS. Yeah, I guess. So I'm not confident with these ones at all. So Wanna know something? Wanna know two things terrible happened in that fall to me? What happened? One time I fell so fast, I fell through the floor and died in the lava. Oh no, that's one of the most N64 things I've heard. I'm gonna lie. And the other thing, the other thing was, because of the wall's collision of the opening, it pushed me into the lava and I died. Oops. And I don't think that's an N64 thing, I think that's more of a collision thing with Rayman 2. Yeah, I guess. I was just joking around. I mean, it totally does sound like an N64 thing with the first thing, how I fell through the floor. Yep. Right, can we not screw up this? We can screw up this, oh. nice. Uh, try shooting it when you turn this corner. Right. Yeah, something like that. Nice. Because usually when I turn around that corner, that's when I start shooting at the switch. What? Even if... Man. Oh, that's annoying. That, that ledge is annoying. It's happened to me too, so I know the feeling. Oh. You know why? Because I tried to go too fast. Too oh, furious. Wow. Too fast and too furious. I like to joke with those three platforms saying that they're the safest jumps I ever do in the game. Hmm. Oh, really? Because, yeah, because I have to wait on that wall cycle to go back in. Oh, wow. Um, we're losing some time, sadly. But it's fine. At least you didn't lose a big chunk of time on the flower auto scroller. Wait, maybe we're saving? Nah, not. That was kind of close. Twenty-eight 
29 comes here. All right, can you do walk of life? Or sorry, walk of power properly. Um, I probably won't do the early cycle thing because I'm still not consistent with it. But we'll see. Yeah, fair enough. Oh, by the way, Mario 64 runner cheese. Uh, he's finally learning frame walk in JRB. Huh. Which originally he hated it so much. Really? Yes. I've tried it for fun and it's very awkward and my thumb gets very tired with it. Oopsies. Let me try this actually. I think you got it. Uh, you did get it, but you took a bad line with that lum. Yeah. Can I recover? I can. Yeah, you can get an extra. Oh yeah, I forgot. I, I wanted to say I, I could get a tomb. Um, but I guess not. But because there's a lum barrier thingy. Honestly, I think getting an, getting an extra tomb lum would have been slower than just getting an extra one there. Yeah, maybe. And even then, th th again, there's one barrier. Uh, with this level you're talking about, right? Yeah, that means I would need to get one extra lum you... if I wanted to get enter beneath. No, you had enough, because it's, four fi it's 450 to enter Walk of Power. Yeah, but and it's 475. Yeah, and you got you got twenty nine. Do you see the math? Oh, I forgot. Again, I'm rusty. Pro speedrunner teaches basic speedrunner basic math. For real? What's funny is that I'm I, I chose a math profile from high school. Hmm. That should be that should be your next YouTube video. <laughs> <laughs> True. I know Cheese has something like that sometimes when he does his streams. <laughs> also, no gold fist here kind of sucks because um, the strength of the entrance to the second uh, part of the Nislava sucks. Yeah, well, without without charge shot and without gold gloves. Yeah. <laughs> I've also noticed you guys do that. I don't do it. Why? Lag? I'm bad at it. Because I'm bad at it. Oh. Skill issue then. But, Sad. Yes. Well, it's also the fact that I ha it's hard to have the mental strength to practice it because of how slow this level is. Oh. <clears throat> so it's both a uh, skill issue and that. Hmm. Why did I get 9 plus notifications on Discord? What? Bruh, and to see this later. I still totally understand why my friend Aaron loves this level casually. I also love it, it's in my top three. Nice touch. I think it's a great level casually, but speedrunning it, it's very boring for me. Yeah, because it's an auto -scro scroller. Yeah, I mean, most auto scrollers I like, but this one, it's. One of my least favorite. Understandable. Mm hmm I mean, it's fun to optimize in certain areas where you have to keep on the ground, but there's very little ground in this level. Yeah, except for like this bit and some other little bits. This is like not even 1% of the level, probably. Mm hmm I did figure out a roll boost line up to get to this frame and then walk off. Nice. Uh, did you skip that lum on purpose? I do that normally. So you did? Yes, I do that normally. Okay. Yeah, I have Sometimes enough. I want. Sometimes I wonder if that lum's e even worth going for. Mmm, I guess. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I personally don't know either. Oh yeah, when I did the any percent of this, I had a really bad pouch. Really? Did you die? No, I didn't die. I just had bad roll boosting because I took damage in dumb ways with from the fire. Oh. And because I took damage, I had to recover my roll boost. Oh, you do roll boost pouch. Ouch. 
I mean, it's not that hard. And it's, hard. and it's faster. To be fair, you have excellent moments to jump. I what? Whatever, I just said it incorrectly. Oh. All I know is I do roll boosting, and if I, if I do the movement correctly, then I can save time. Also, have you noticed when I respawn, I go into first person? Never mind, I guess. Not doing it. Uh, have you noticed that, Vitamin? Um, what again? When I respawn from Fouch, have you noticed I go into first person? Um, no. Well, the reason why I do that was just to get the purple lum to move so I don't have to do an extra bounce off the web. Oh. You know what I want to do there, by the way? What? I wanted to damage boost, I mean, lump boost, so that I could get out of bounds. Oh, yes. Because Which, I uh... was kinda half consistent with it. Yeah, I, I know that now. <laughs> Which I'm happy I got those in my ILs. Were people scared of the spider? I wasn't. Also, I'm I not wasn't really scared either. in games, I'm just annoyed. Hmm. I wasn't scared of him, I was... Because I already had PTSD from Jano. Oh. Interesting. Also, I wonder how much harder Switch 3 skip is on PC. Probably a lot. Because... Uh, do you jump higher than 64? Uh... I mean, the area's not that laggy, honestly. I mean, it just it just depends on the jump timing for the piranha cycle. Huh. Well, here it could be because... harder because of higher FPS, maybe. Uh, probably. Because if I get damage on a specific cycle, I can make it onto the platform. If I barely don't have enough, I can do a backup, which is getting a frame-perfect jump off the corner. Huh. I mean, you gotta know your backups, right? Yep. And you know what else I'm gonna do today? I'm gonna risk something and do the big jump. Uh, I just... But try shooting before you get to the ledge. Okay, fine. I mean, it could prevent the pirate from shooting you off. Yeah. Ah! Oh man. Yep. Oh well. Can still try again. I'm not re resetting. This is gonna be probably my last run. What was that? Like, hello? Nice hitbox game. I think I think um, the problem was that uh, my shots um, despawned. Is there I know sometimes... Game? I know sometimes if they hit the corner of those gears, it doesn't count. Hmm. PB would be dead anyway, so who really cares? By the way, did you know I have a visual cue to know when to get out of first person on that barrel? No. Also, wow, this it was just... really bad. <laughs> ah. Well... The visual cue, if you're wondering, it's basically as soon as the barrel lights up. Yeah. Oh crap, Oopsie asked if I could ask him if he's still speedrun on N64. Well, yeah. Oh, he was asking me something? Um, Oopsie was asking something. And... Yes, I he asked it 12 minutes ago. I'm such a good chat reader. Oh well. Now this will make it. 
Yeah, that's the strat I was talking about. Oh, you got, oh, you got hooked. Yeah, that that's why I really don't want to attack earlier. I want to mm. attack later. Well, I mean, there's something you can do if you get hooked. Attack, I guess. Well, not just attacking, but also helicoptering to cancel the, the damage momentum. Oh right, I forgot about that. That's something I take advantage of with the spider and canopy. Hmm. Okay, finally. Wasted two minutes. It's fine. I love how that pirate's shooting into the wall. Yeah. That shows he was programmed well by Razorbeard. <laughs> to be fair, I say I'm not that mad I lost the run here. Um, because I would have been actually kind of mad if I PB'd with this run. Uh, I see what you're saying, that it was just a mediocre run and it's still PB'd. Yeah. Actually, it wasn't that mediocre. I was just really playing bad with the glitches. Oh. Also, roll boost. I huh? thought you... Well, you actually got the Z target roll boost. What? Wow. You know it's sad? I don't... I don't I don't actually go for that roll boost, sadly. Yeah, nobody does. <laughs> that was just an accident. Because I, like... I feel like it's not worth it, personally. It's not. Honestly. Like, what does it even save? Like, three uh, frames? Probably three games. frames. <laughs> In Mario 64, that would matter, but the thing is, this is Rayman 2. Yeah. I would love to check what are my pinks, but I guess I can't because I'm holding the triangle button. Hmm. Oh, I was gonna note something. Yeah? Oh yeah, that barrel jump in the previous section, I figured out another thing that makes it tricky is that the barrel is floating up and down in a cycle. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I didn't notice that until, uh, I guess after I respawned to try it again. Hmm. I noticed the barrel was going on a different cycle than I was used to. Can I get this one? Honestly, this is my least favorite pirate in R2 PC. Like, what is this, man? Uh, you got too close to him. I guess, but what could I have done? I'll walk on the geometry, because it's... Because you can walk on it. What? No way. Yeah, that red slanted geometry on that pillar, you can walk on it. Wow, didn't know that. Oh, you thought it was like a wall or something? Yeah, or a slope or something. That couldn't... You couldn't walk on. Oh, I get what you're saying. But yeah, you can walk on that geometry. So you say that's your least favorite pirate on PC? It's my yeah. least favorite on N64. <laughs> wow. But because I really hate walking with the keg here. Woo! That was kind of close. Surprised he didn't grab you. Yeah, same. I mean, it's fine with the barrel, but the problem I have with it is just walking around him is a little awkward, and also the fact how sometimes it does not break the door for me. Hmm. <laughs> But if you remember, that happened in one of my 100% attempts. I guess. Ooh, nice. I got health recharge. Also, if you want to guess how much time I'm behind. Uh, three minutes. Less. Two and a half. One minute, 53 seconds. But I lost two oh, minutes, wow. basically. Oh, wow. Hm. Okay, I'm gonna try s the lamp boost I have redone. Which is like with this camera setup. Uh, that's kind of a bad one. Yeah, I'm just gonna do the normal way. Yeah, not even I do that camera setup because Rayman can target the first purple lump. Oh, so that's what he does. Yes, because, it because it's off camera and the hitbox is still loaded. Oh... But if you put know. it back, 
Yeah, but if you put it back on camera, uh, the hitbox unloads. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna make and it. Oh! You would have. Because I, but I was playing too silly. That is the problem. Mm hmm. That's why when I get to this purple um, I try to press C down to unload the first purple um's hitbox. Hmm. Oh no, why did I helicopter through? That was a bad decision. Uh. Alright, you, you can still make it. Alright. I know she go more to the left. That's not really the best thing. I don't know. I do whatever in there, honestly. Okay. I had to reposition my thumb. Mm. That was too early, man. Uh, if you did a good helicopter, I think you could make it. Barely. Oh, yikes, this is questionable. Yeah, this is really questionable. <laughs> ah. Honestly, I think a roll boost jump could make the jump a little more lenient. Maybe, but like nobody does it. I don't think it's gonna make it. Uh, probably barely not. Yeah, I'm not no. yet even getting bound. Wow. Yeah, I, I noticed nobody does a roll boost jump there. Because it looks like, if anything, that would make the jump a little easier. Uh, who was said to found this, uh, this, uh, glitch? Coco and Robin? You know what's sad? I actually knew about it before they even said it. Wow! Why didn't you say anything, man? Because I didn't think it was worth it, and I didn't time it, and also how hard it was. It's worth sharing anything. Well, the thing is, I'm also new to all this Discord and streaming and all that. I guess. So, the thing is, I still think they deserve the credit for sharing it. This angle is really bad. <laughs> Sometimes I think it's a little better being on the right because you go back in bounds and it could give you a small boost. Hmm. Maybe I could still save it. Uh. Yeah, I might think have I to can. curve. Yeah, you could curve a bit. Yeah, easy. Not as lean compared to mine, though. <laughs> yeah, yours is too easy. Yeah, like you saw, I had a horrible angle, and I still made it. Hey! No hey, haste, Kevin. already knows how to do boat skip, but he doesn't think it's worth it. <laughs> Kobo, I swear. What, me knowing how to do boat skip? Yeah. And Rayman committed suicide. I wish, but I'm being legit honest, I don't. Hmm. No ramen game has boat skip. I mean, what? man, one's rival. impossible. I mean, one's impossible because it's a boss fight. Yeah. Two, I see the most potential, but the thing is, we don't know. I don't. I see more potential in three, to be honest. Uh, three, I could see, but I don't know anything about three. But to be fair, the trigger to end the level is kind of far. Uh. Like really also, really Vitamin, fun. Vitamin, you might need to learn how to do this wall run on, uh, with my setup. I don't know. Is it really that good? Uh, it's not. It's not even slower, and it, honestly, it's much easier to get the wall run. Also, I started syncing up my um, boost button with the song. Hmm. Mm hmm. And I do it once or twice now. That's good. Oh, you're talking about the lumbus? Yeah. Oh, by the way, you, who does branch skip? 
Who does branch skip? <laughs> so anyway. Anyway, how are you? Oh crap! I I I, I almost fell 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 asleep. <laughs> well, you definitely took damage. That's for sure. Yup, we're gonna lose the boat like Thorson. Huh. By the way, um, if you die in the boat, do you still have your teens? Uh, not teens, he's ba baby gums are saved? Ha! <laughs> no. Oh. You'd have to be an idiot to believe that. I don't know, man. Anything is possible. Like, I would believe Revel could do that, but I doubt it. Because, but I could believe that because Revel is so broken. Do you know how I know this? How? It's called testing. No way, you test the game? No way. Imagine. Oh yeah, I have to, I have to test for certain glitches to see if they're possible or... I mean, hey, I'm still trying to test to see boat skip. If my ship explodes with all baby ghosts, so it will they be safe? <laughs> That's what I said. All I know is I did get the final baby glow boxes. I died on purpose, and then when I went back, Rayman just said, "Oops, I missed one." Oops, I missed one. The thirteen pirate mines in question. Imagine if there are thirteen mines. That would be the worst thing of all time. I mean, four mines is already horrible as it is. So I can check Discord because, yeah. Oh, by the way, guys, 10 years later. Oh, some, by the like, way. class thingy. <laughs> hey, when I did this in my stream, I like how you guys were joking around saying it was the best part of the game. It was the best part of the game. You can see so much detail here. The boat rotates. Mm -hmm. Part 2 you can see coming all soon. You can see all the muddy textures on N64 compared to game to the, the PC game. Yeah. Also, Revo is Revo, like at least on PSN, is slightly more interesting. Also, oh my gosh, I'm scared. Okay. I I'll be honest. I think that camera was m one of the most amusing things I've ever seen on the auto scroller. Yeah. Um, in Revo uh, PSN, um, one texture glitches, and that's like the most interesting part of this level. <laughs> I totally forgot where the texture glitch is. It's when you're going back to Aglet, and near the oh. entrance to the, like, river thingy to the beginning, whatever. I'm river. gonna say where. I maybe even shoot at it. Okay, thank you. When you say river, do you mean the poison water? Yes. Actually, I don't know what it would be called. A stream? I don't know. But anyway, it's right there. I mean, around there. Oh, I think I've seen it, but I probably forgot about it. In my runs, it happens. Maybe if I look back on your all-familiar uh, run, maybe I could see it. Also, speaking of cages from your spirits... If I manage to learn Raymond 2 PS1 all cages, then I could do something really cool. Oh, that'd be interesting. Yeah, like a marathon where I uh, speedrun all cages category in all 3D running games. I know something that would be torturous for my brain, but I think I could do it. Oh, wow. What if I did all the categories in one go? Honestly though, actually, Cobble, I have a question for you. Since our 320 anniversary is coming soon, are you gonna do something special on that day? Just out of curiosity. Slide time. I'm gonna actually do these slides, diagonal slides, something that I'm not consistent with. Especially the second part of the level. Ah, uh, hi, Rayman. Yeah, I still need to learn how to do this. I mean, it it takes a moment to get a feel with diagonal sliding on certain slanted geometry. Yeah. Am I gonna bonk? Yeah. 
sure. Still yeah, usually if you if you're at that if you're at that elevation, you're most likely gonna bonk. Yeah, not super. I thought it. I thought I was close, but I hit it. So. Time for the most satisfying one. I'm happy on my any percent IL how good the slide was. Yeah, it was good. Especially getting the window jump. Oh, that was not good. Oh. Was, I mean, it was good, but like, not the best of all time. Oh, you mean not the fastest? Yeah. Oh, did you notice the jump I do here? Where? Uh, that that ramp you just passed. No. Also, oh, in my I IL, I did a... Uh, in my IL, I actually jumped and I guess basically almost barely killed myself so I could get a speed boost. Huh. <gasps> because there's a trigger that pushes Rayman forward and I use it to get a boost. Hmm. Imagine if saying that K thingy K that you said would be not allowed on Twitch regardless of the context. Uh, what thing? Uh, you know, the kill part. The ramp? No, what you said. The slanted part? No, about killing like, someone. Ow. Oh. That's really mean to say. <gasps> that was stupid. Oh gosh. I didn't think I said uh, killing anything other, other than just killing Rayman. Yeah, that's what we meant. Oh. Well, whoops. <laughs> please, please don't misinterpret this, everybody. Yeah, no context of anime. <laughs> hmm. There could be this a lot of shell... context stuff. Yeah. This flying shell music, I love it so much in all the versions. Huh. It's cool, yeah. I'll see the Revo, it's... Wait, I forgot if in Revo it plays the um, the song without some instruments or with all of them. Uh, it's the same to me. Because in Water and Knives, it's um, it's the less instruments version. Yeah, in other words, the original soundtrack. Yeah. Found it. You know what I should always say here when I get here? What you should say? Do a barrel roll. Yep, expected that, honestly. I mean, I'm barrel rolling, basically, so I why saved. shouldn't I say that? I saved! I'm an idiot. I need to make a new file later. Huh. And still can't leave two hard doors. But man, the ILs I did on this boss fight. Yeah. I, I would have liked to cap. I would have liked to try to get that sub 130, but honestly, I just didn't have enough time. Fair, honestly. Mm -hmm. Who does have time in life, honestly? I mean, on weekends, I usually do. I guess. I swear, if you do this, yeah, I thought not. You were thinking about it, weren't you? Yes. I was. Did I hit? I didn't shoot twice, I think. Oops. By the way, when you were doing yeah. ILs here, I was really scared you were gonna bonk. Uh, when I was trying to cut these corners? Yeah. I've done this a hundred times, I know the feel for this. Like, even if I do a slight tap bonk, I can easily orient myself back. Also, it's also the fact I know what? the collision and Ray... Wow. It's also the fact I know the collision and Rayman's hitbox. I guess that's fair. That was not smart of me, honestly. I Were you trying to do... The... Were you trying to do fast kill? No, I literally just smashed into Volvo. 
I know, but I'm saying, why did you do that? I don't know, why did I do that, man? That was so stupid of me. And Probably, sub 115 uh, could have been cool, but oh well. I guess because you were used to seeing me try that with a uh, fast kill. Yeah, I blame you. I'm sorry. I'm kidding. <laughs> I know. I know this tunnel I used to be scared of when I started runs. But now it's just basically another day in the office. <laughs> the Raymond speedrunning HQ. Yep. Better than the Hoodlum headquarters with that horrible machine True. that you saw flop on. Or the Rabbit headquarters. Yeah. And GG. That was 115.08. I think this was decent for a comeback. For a D-Rust uh, run, I think it's alright. Yeah, this was the first run I finished. Um, after coming back, so that's not bad. Definitely better than the... Uh, this is actually the best run I had while in Call of Pain. Oh, wow. So that's something. <laughs> hey, isn't this the only one you've had with me? Um, the other was 119 something. Oh, okay, fair. By the way, Rayman died. Sorry, everybody. Yeah, sad. He's never in a any other game ever again. Nope. No, that's... No, not in Rayman 3. That's a different guy. Apparently, there are French subtitles for R2 Roll Boost video. Well... You know who that Rayman is in Rayman 3? It's his long-lost brother, me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm funny. Yeah. We're gonna do Nemesis, obviously. Alright, which again, thanks for telling me the Nemesis code. Yeah, but did you not... I, I think you can even control Razorbeard there. Uh, yeah, you can control Razorbeard on the credits. I've seen uh, Mono Cheese do it, but I don't remember the code for it. I think it's the same as for um, the the nemesis. Just without C left. Yeah, and I can control him. I don't understand the point of this. Cool Easter egg, I guess. Okay, let's wait for a person in the credits that's gonna appear soon. Actually, what's the point in life these days? True. I wonder when he's gonna appear. Oh, by the way, when I uh, when I plan on streaming Sunshine, I hope I don't get banned for the one level that caused the thing that's happening Robin! these days. <laughs> Alright. Ah, uh, you get what I'm saying, Vitamin. Um, uh, for what? Uh, you know the one level at the end of Sunshine. Oh, I know what it is. Yeah, do you think it'll get banned for it being in there? Maybe in 2020, but nah, I don't think so. Okay, because I know in a YouTube video somebody was hesitant to say it. But to be fair, it, it could have been at the early 2020 when it was kind of controversial to say the thing. True, but all I know is I think that's basically where it came from. But to be fair, that level is a perfect representation of 2020. Mm hmm well, I mean, that's basically the cause of our problems. Yep. People don't know it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Hi, Robin. I just finished a run and I'm doing Nemesis. Hi, Robin. <laughs> well, I gotta say, I need to practice the long boost for sure. Because that's like, I'm still not the best at. A for 20. Oh, oops. Wow, you're bad at menaces. Oh well. <laughs> Let's do some practice before we end. Honestly, when I come back, uh, D Rusted, maybe I should do a practice stream. Maybe. Yeah, if at least I something to lump boost the most, you can see by my splits. But I lost time on levels that have uh, long boosts. And I also lost time in Tomb because I couldn't do the really swag jump. 
thingy uh, in Tomb 2. Oh, uh, yuck. Who dies in Tomb these days? For real. I'm getting I do. <laughs> Especially the fact of me adding Switch 3 skip. <laughs> Some will find consistent setup in the future, I swear. I'm too much to the right, I noticed that. I just noticed that today, uh, the day and the month um, numbers are uh, kind of parallelograms. 21st of 12th uh, month. Lol. Ah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. That was interesting. That was for sure interesting. I've got this one more try. No, no. <laughs> this is not for NMG. I can do one. Oh, you got it. Oh, you have to hit a switch. Oh, right. Yeah, because there's two lasers in there. Right, I forgot. Also, this could definitely be implemented in Revel All Masks, maybe. But the question is if that's optimal. Uh. Probably not. Yeah, because you could. The other target is good there. Well, the thing is, is that you could shoot the first target, then jump in the crack. Maybe? Uh -huh. But we did some cool gloves today, I gotta say. Finally did the good water and ice. And did Fairy Glade today. And Bayou, um... I'm a, a GLM. That was cool. Top of the world, that's a fake god. Oh, I just got cut off. Huh. I'm probably gonna replace it. Actually, I don't know. Should I keep that god? Meh, who cares? I can still get a better one, probably. All right. I wonder if it's being on the right side or the left side going to this box. I don't know. I think it's easier. I, feel like, I think it's right because uh, you get pushed back in bounds and get a small boost. Maybe. But yeah, not getting this was kinda yikes, but what's funny is that I still was at PB pace. Oh, uh, would you like to know a backup you could've done? What could I have done? Uh, when you tried to fix it, and... Like, basically, <clears throat> with how your angle is right now, if you messed it up and swung like this, you could've jumped off and then turn around and shoot. So that you don't get hit by the bomb? Uh, that too, but also because Rayman will start swinging sooner. And also the, f it's also the fact he jumps higher when he's when he jumps forward instead of jumps backwards. <laughs> Bye, Rayman. That was funny. Oh, he's gonna fall off, isn't he? No. Yep. Oh wow, he fell into Bayou too. What a surprise. You are such a liar. <laughs> <laughs> Every time you have to ruin my childhood. <laughs> to be fair, you know more about R2 than me. Eh, true. What's your experience with uh, R2, as you like to say? Um, I uh, First time I played PC version was actually this year. Yeah, wow. But I did play the the first version I completed was PS1 from the PSN store back in 2016. 
if I remember wow. correctly. And then 2020 I got Rayman 3D and I beat that too. Rayman 3D, as in the 3DS version. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Um and then I acquired the Revo in March 2022 when I realized that I could make an American PSN account or something like that. Wow. Hi Ankun. Welcome to the stream. Nice experience. And there's still some verse I need to play. A VC, I'm already in the VC. Hi. Uh, let's try this again. Here's something I don't remember if I first played Rayman 2 or Rayman 1. <laughs> um, yeah, that's a good one. Did you, what, did, when did you get your first PlayStation? <laughs> Cause I did grow up with a PlayStation 1 when I was a kid. I thought you grew up with like N64. No, I had... When I was a kid, I had N64, PS1, and Super Nintendo. Oh. Super Nintendo? Whoa. Yeah, it was actually my sister's. <clears throat> Is she older? Yes. <clears throat> I'm not surprised then. And unfortunately, she's going through issues. Financial ones? Uh... More mental ones. Oh no. I hope she feels better. Same. I miss her. But when, when we were kids, we actually played Donkey Kong Country so much. Oh, nice. I guess the high difficulty of Donkey Kong Country got me into the difficulty with Rayman 1 and Crash Bandicoot 1. Maybe. Speaking of which, I acquired Rayman 1 recently, so I can like, start streaming it soon. I'd like to watch. Yeah, the, the problem is that I got the, the, the PSN version in the European PSN store, which I think is the European version, which is slower. Because of frame rate? Yeah. 50 FPS. But it shouldn't be that big of an issue. I think. Nah, I don't know about that. I don't know. If if I had to speedrun the game, I would probably use either an emulator or a PS2. I mean, all those is doing emulator. To be fair, top runners are using emulators. Because of loads. That too, but also because it's the most accessible version. Mm. All I know is uh, Croc speedrunners don't use emu. Oh wow. <laughs> I guess Croc hates emus, the animals. Yeah. <laughs> Lol. Oh, by the way, if anyone's in chat, just know uh, you guys need to learn my uh, my way of exiting this water cave because it's <laughs> faster. <laughs> Interesting. Let me try this. I'm actually curious. I'm not do this torque strat. Nah, that's not it. That's not good. It should be good. Never mind. I was wrong. Are you trying the the consistent setup? Uh, I'm doing the one with a visual cue at the bottom. No, I'm saying are you swimming forward then swimming down and shooting? What? Okay, so basically when you set yourself up, are you swimming up then just going for it? Yeah. That's the YOLO setup. Really? Is it really more yeah. consistent to do the attack thingy? Because, uh, what Torg9 does, he does, uh, the, he does a consistent setup. But it's a slower one, though. True. Okay. 
I know there's some people who do the consistent, while some do the YOLO. Mm -hmm. I hate this camera, man. Whoa, that was a weird boost. You know who I think was secretly this cameraman? Who? Laka 2. I this is actually- I think this is Bzit. Oh gosh, no, not Bzit. Because- uh, there's no locked camera so I can show. Let me go to Paradise 2. Because I noticed something similar when I was a kid. Can I rotate the camera? Here we go. He was, it looks kind of like Bzit. Really? In terms of shapes. I never saw it like that. I just... What's strange is I actually saw it as some kind of key. Oh. I've actually gone so fast here, I went over the wall and out of bounds here. Oh, wow. I still need to learn how to think. By the way, I yeah, wonder if you can that... see this looks kind of like zit and of. Oh, it kind of does. Yeah, uh, the black thing is uh, his, like, I don't know, his orange thingy. I don't know what yeah, his, I it. his nose. Yeah, then there are the eyes with the wheels. Right. And the rest speaks for itself. Mm -hmm. I try. I still try to see if the backwards slide would work for me here. I've gotten it a couple times, but it doesn't feel 100% consistent to me. But I, I, I recently found out why doing this is kind of risky, maybe. Yeah, because you could accidentally shoot the icicle. Yeah. Ow! Ow! Ooh! Whoa! That's not, oh, yeah. That kind of sounds like Sonic here, not gonna lie. <laughs> okay. Well, actually, that is another set of vocal effects I don't think of so much. Yeah, those are uh, underappreciated. Well, There's it's because... one that's like, ah! Or whatever. Ah! Ah! No! <laughs> oh, wait, we have a fail name, Sue. I'm really bad at this second jump here recently. Not gonna lie. I'm garbage at it. Um, can I try to tell what angle you're doing? Yeah. I see you doing more left. Because when I usually do this, I try to go more down left if I can set Rayman up correctly. Hmm. Center left. Yeah, because when you go through that wall, I see Rayman's angle is left. Which, honestly, I think that actually makes it harder. Interesting. I got pink. Because when I get Rayman stuck on the wall, at the very least, I try to hold down left instead of left. Huh. Oh, my friend is streaming. No way. But he's not streaming ramen. So, no right for, for him, I guess. I think we're gonna be done here for today. This was cool. We kind of de-rusted almost. Also happy I could provide some tips for the game for you. Yeah, thanks for being here. I appreciate it. No problem. I mean, we're all in this together, right? Yep. So, now, what are the streamers? We got one with ramen. We got one with ramen too. Uh, well, guys, uh, I gotta be going. I'm happy I could be here with you guys. It. Have a good day, everybody. It's see ya. Bye. Bye. Okay. Well, I don't see anybody to raid, so I guess we're just gonna end off here. But I'm really happy with my performance. Hopefully, I can do better next time. But yeah, that's watching. I hope I can see you again soon. Bye.